So it's not that important, guys, to have like a huge cock. I will do my best. Okay. <laughs> Let's have some tea. Mm. <laughs> Bienvenue à tous. Nous sommes avec Little Caprice sur Peach Farmer. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing very you nice. The first question is, how did you fall into this industry? Unexpected. <laughs> Imagine. Let me all back and wait for the answer. Okay, so I started when I was 19. The first input why I did this job was I needed money. After a few scenes and like showing myself in the camera and opening my sexuality, I find out that this is something what I really mm. like. I feel really comfortable. So that's interesting. When you saw yourself, you knew that was something for you? Yeah, I was super shy. On the other side, it was kind of exciting for me. You see you yeah, yeah. actually do it. Yeah. Do you keep watching your uh, doing? I do. Watching like how I'm performing. Yeah, I'm professional. Professional, professional, yeah. Did you have trouble telling your family about this? I didn't have trouble to tell my family because somebody else did it for me, <gasps> which was not that nice, you know, because my mother like received the pictures of me with the cock in the mouth, Ouch. which was pretty shocking for her, I can believe. But my mother is very open-minded and she trusts me and she knows who I am. So she has completely not a problem with it because she knows that I'm standing on my own feet. She knows that it's just a job. Actually, it's a blood job. I'm sorry. I'm a... Oh, man. <laughs> I'm telling you my life story here. Come on. No, no. <laughs> my mother and my family, they are kind of really proud of me for everything what I achieved in this business. So yeah, you did actually achieve a lot. I'm so. really lucky to have family like this. It's just a job like anything else, you know? True. And the real friends accepted it as well. So. And who didn't is his problem. <laughs> They're not in your life anymore. Anyway. Exactly. In the industry, we saw all these guys that are huge all the time. And we understand that it's supposed to be huge. I don't like where it's going. She's already laughing. She's going to tell me something terrible. But technically, if you are with a non-professional, is there a size where it's way too small? It's impossible to, to work I mean, with? It is for sure, but I never had this experience. Yeah. But I mean, the size is not really matter. And honestly, in real life, these kind of sizes are not really practical for having sex. So, so it's not that important, guys, to have like a huge cock. There there is hope, guys. We can do it's it. Hope, it's a possibility for us. It's important if you can use we it. We need right. to use our fingers. No, not only fingers, but you need to use it hot. I will do my best. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I will ask your wife. Yeah? <laughs> Freeze. We wonder, is there feeling starting to grow when you are with a co-star? If I'm on the scene, of course, there have to be chemistry. It's just in the moment. But after that, the camera stops and that's it. For our point of view, what you're doing is very intimate. I'm enjoying in that moment, but after that, no. Most of us are very professional. My husband is also working with other girls. Why I know that I can let him and I'm not jealous at all because I know this cannot happen, you know? Feels interesting. You're not doing this, Lucy. <laughs> Come on! If you had a message for all the men that say porno reflect an unrealistic sexualities. I would tell them maybe go and watch my website because with my husband, uh, we are trying to change this view to be like more real and showing not only the men but also the couples how it really can be. Little so, Caprice dreams. Little Caprice dreams, exactly. Yeah. So there is not only fake porn, guys. There can be also real porn. We want them to have fun. So we mostly don't shoot like the whole day or like two days for a scene like some big productions do because then the people have no fun anymore during the sex part, which is the most important thing. Yeah, we are trying to change it a little bit. It's funny because when you talk about it, it feels like you're talking about sports. We need to have fun. After all, it's all about it fun. Is. It mean, is. It is, actually. I know. We can agree on what Capri say. Fun should be a focus. Let's have fun. Cheese. <laughs> I love it. Beach Farmer, the only place. <sighs> you can ask real questions. I love it. I don't know. I'm trying to <laughs>